everybody, welcome back to another video. Today is very, very exciting because we are finally going on our European holiday. So today we're flying from Darwin, Australia to London in the UK and I was just about to do a final pack of my carry-on and I thought I'd show you what I'm taking. I don't know if I'm being a bit extra, I've never done a long haul flight before, but this is everything that I'm taking with me. So I have two carry-on bags. I've got like this big tote bag and then I've also got this little crossbody bag that I'm taking. Um, but in the big one, I have some spare clothes. So I've got a pair of comfy track pants for the long haul flight as well as a plain white t-shirt and some clean socks for when we land. So we land at 6 a.m. We have a whole day in London. So I just wanted like a clean, fresh outfit to wear when we get there. I also have my jumper in case it gets cold. This is my one from the Wellness Cafe. It is so cute. It's got like little cherry and bows on the back. Love it. And then those two are gonna go in the very bottom pocket or bottom section of the bag. There's also got a couple of side pockets. So in there I have some snacks. So I've got a peanut butter bar. I've got some mango fruit straps and then also some gluten-free lollies for just some snacking in case I get hungry on the plane. Down the side, I've got my water bottle. I obviously am taking this empty and I will fill it up once we're through security. Then I've got all my liquids in a bag. I do have a little pouch for all of this. So they're going to go in here once we're through security, but it's like a bit of a mixed bag. I've got some medical stuff. I've got some toiletries and some makeup all in there. Honestly, like heaps of different things. And then in here is just like my makeup brushes and things, but it all fits into the one pouch. But I'm leaving it separate so that I don't have to go through it in the security line. In here is like my little long haul survival kit. I don't know if I'm going to need all this stuff, but I've got like an eye mask. I've got some cleansing face wipes. I've got a packet of pocket tissues, some medicines and my compression socks. So I'll pull this out when we get to Singapore because we have a five hour layover in Singapore. And then for the side, I've got my computer. So this is in my laptop case. It's honestly not the most aesthetic case on the planet, but it works. So I've got my laptop in there and then in the pocket, I've got like my external hard drive and then my adapter for USBs and things like that. So, and then finally in my big bag, I also have my iPad. I'll probably take this out to be on the plane. It'll be with me the whole time, but it just fits in here nicely for now. And then I have my little neck pillow attached to the side. It's quite heavy because it has my laptop and stuff in it, but I really like this bag because it's kind of cute. It's like a little quilted bag. It's actually from Target. It's like a dupe for the My Mum Made It brand, but they're super cute. Then for my little bag, this is also from Nia at Strand Bags, and it's just like such a cute little color. I love it. Yeah, so I've got my Kindle first and foremost. I'm probably going to read for most of the flight. Um, I've also got some movies on my iPad in case I want that. I need to move some of these lip products out. I don't know why they all ended up in here, um, but I've got two Summer Fridays lip balm and my Dior lip oil. I'm probably going to pop these into that bag. Then I've got my wallet with like my IDs and everything. I have our passports, got my passport and Jaden's in our little cases that I showed in my prep with me. So this is all from my near haul that I showed you guys. Some gum, some dead oil wipes, pocket tissues and Nurofen, my asthma inhaler and a pen, and then my little headphones. And I'll also be carrying my Air Maxes. And that is everything I'm taking on this long haul flight. So like I said, I haven't done one before and I'm really, really hoping that I have like everything I need. I've tried to think through everything. You never know. And it's not the end of the world. They have a lot of stuff on the planes. I've got everything I need to be comfortable, I think. So I think I need to finish packing my suitcase quickly zip that up and then my dad's picking us up in about 20 minutes to take us to the airport so that's so exciting but I hope you enjoyed this video if you do make sure you give it a like and subscribe to my channel let's finish packing this and go to the airport but it's like 1am London time at the moment so really hoping to get a little bit more sleep I'm just it's like 6am home time now so I don't feel like I feel like maybe getting up so I'm gonna try and get a couple more hours of sleep but everyone else on the plane is sleeping so obviously I don't want to vlog and keep them up so I came to the bathroom to update you so 
Um, and those are the updates. It's going really well. I'm just, um, I can already feel the jet lag. 